Hello, my friends. My name is Dadcraft73, and welcome back to another episode of Project Ozone 3. Not four, five, just three. Hey, we're hanging out here in the Twilight Forest, this is sort of where we ended our last episode. Um, I was like right over there somewhere, not too far away. I've just been running around a little bit here, trying to think about what we were going to do. Um, like, we need to find Yetis, I reckon. That's what we need to find. So we're going to have to get that done. Uh, by the way, I'm, I bound um, a key to hover mode. You guys are 100% right. Now we can hover if we want to. The problem is these jetpacks evidently rip through power pretty quickly. Well, maybe not. Yeah. Let me make sure that this... I don't think this guy is charging. Let's fix that. We do shift, right click. Yeah, now he'll charge. And now this guy. Here. Okay. Press V to change V. Yeah, now it should work. Yeah, okay. Now it works. So anyway, um, we're here... Sorry. <laughs> we got to figure out what we need to do. What we really need to do is make a magic map, I think. Um, I think that should be probably the first thing. That means we need to find a hollow hill because we need... Um, or like a cave or something. Let's see if we can't find some torch berries sooner than later, if possible. And a raven. And then we can make a magic map pretty quickly and easily. Don't we'll need that stuff. We're looking for... We need to find a cave... Um, I also think that we have to kill something in the Twilight Forest. I don't know if it really matters. Um, it's funny because I didn't really want to come to the Twilight Forest because this morning, <laughs> if you watched my episode with Piggy and Zloy, um, we we spent a long time in the Twilight Forest messing around. But whatever. Um, this is a whole different deal. All right, let's go find a cave of some sort. Or a raven. Like, sometimes ravens, I think, hang around these little, like, pillars over here. Hello, raven? Like that. Okay. Now I see you found a torchberry. Is there some down here, maybe? I need, like, a cave. Somewhere down under where we can go. There's a lich tower. That's funny. Those aren't caves. Um, is that a cave maybe? Yes. Right there. Torchberries. Now we just need a piece of glowstone dust, which we could probably get from our house if we really wanted to go back there and grab it. But I think over here, perhaps, is one of these hills, these hollow hills. And I bet we could just go rolling up in there and just tear it up. Right? Well. Is this a hollow hill, maybe? I don't know. Let's go inside and see. Let's turn this guy on to, like, 3x3 mode. That's fine. Let's look for a piece of glowstone. Uh, this does not appear to be, like, a hollow hill. Doesn't seem to be anything hollow about it. It looks like it would be, but I don't know. Maybe not. Okay, we gotta find a piece of glowstone. I bet the easiest way. Let's do this. Let's just go back to the house, and we'll grab some glowstone because we have to find yetis if we can. We have to like just throw all this stuff away. We don't need any of it. Okay. All right, so let's get our little handy dandy warp stone out here, and we'll just run back to the house quick. Home. And we're going to make a... We, so we need to make a map anyway, right? So we need to make a blank map like this. All right. Okay, what is this thing is made out of? This. So this right here is like this. We can make that, and then we can make this. Okay, we do not want to look at it until we get back to the Twilight Forest. We have food, we have everything that we need. We're in pretty good shape. Let's go back. Here. Okay. We whisked off to the, the thing. Alright, now if I look at this thing, there's Naga there, 
There's a lich there. I don't know what that is. There's a naga right there. Should we kill these? I mean, I think we need to kill them, right? So we can get the achievement stone. We don't really need them to get... You know, we might as well just go knock them out. I mean, it's going to be super simple. Whatever, crazy naga. Oh, I miss. I'm bad at aiming. Okay. All right, get the goods. There we go. There's that kind of stuff. Oh, look at this. Twilight shaders. Two and play two. Wow, that's pretty cool looking. Some Naga scales. A twilight. A twi. A twilight. <laughs> um, twilight shader bag. And then we got a Naga trophy. Okay, so now we killed a Naga. That's good. All right, and then what's next? Let's take a look. Might as well go here and just like run through these. I can't remember where this stuff is. Ah, right here. I remember. Ram trophy. What is this? We have to do this one too. The ram. Okay. Well, that's fine. And then next is the lich. Okay. So, I mean, is this what we're going to do while we're here? We're just going to run around and fight all these bosses? Right, let's see. Go this way. Okay. We'll run this way. Then we got to, because we have to be able to unlock all these different guys, right? So we can withstand the, we don't have to worry about fighting through either low visibility or whatever it might be. Yeah, there we go. And we're going to absolute, oh, I just lost my sound, it appears. Okay, it's kind of weird. So instead, we're we just going to get in here and fight this guy. He shouldn't be that big of a deal. He should have came in from like the side, I guess. Okay. Where's like the central? That's where we want to go. All right, we're gonna go up here. Hang out up here. Maybe we can like hit him now. This is um somewhat trivialized with um better gear. Okay. Alright, so now we got that done. What do we get? Junk that I don't care about. Uh, oh, we're getting some orange hearts. That's good, right? We don't need any of this stuff. Or this, or this, or this, uh, or uh, that. I guess we can keep. Oh, hello. Okay, so that's done. And now we need to go off to... What's after the lich? Oh, no. Is it the thing? Now it's got to be the other thing, right? 
Um, can I just get out of here? How do I get out? Okay, we just have to fly. Okay, <laughs> that was easy enough. Okay, now, your wings recoil in pain. Why? I don't know why that might be. Here, let's eat this. Oh, okay, and then we could go like way up in the air. We'll activate hover mode, and then we can throw this stuff away. We don't want any of this stuff. Okay, great. Except for life draining, we have that. We don't need that or that. Um, or, or that, I guess, or that. I, mean, I sort of want that zombie scepter, but also not really. Okay, so now I think we have to go to the swamp. We're getting some lag because it has to redraw. Okay. So next up in our order, let's go see. So back. Um, it's going to be the min the minor strips. we got to find a swamp. Where's one on our thing? That's a Naga. Maybe this way? Wow, look at those cool trees. Oh, is this the quest area? That is the quest ram. Cool. Okay. Um, I don't need to worry about him though uh, my man my thing's almost my capacitor that's not that's no joke this thing is certainly like draining my power in a hurry so we may have to run around the ground all right so we've got to find maybe over there what's over there i don't know maybe this way is the way we need to go okay wish i had that step up ability Turn this off. There we go. Hover mode's bad news. Okay, we want to go over this way. We're trying to see what. I do not want to have to go down in that that dumb thing to find the minor swarm shroom. I mean, I will if I have to, I guess, but I'd prefer not to have to do it. Because what I'm, I mean, I guess eventually we're we are going to have to do it, but you know, whatever. Yes, here's the swamp. Oh man, are we going to seriously go down into the labyrinth? Um, where is the labyrinth? This is like right here. Is possible? No, that's a hollow hill. Oh no, it's right here. I don't have any torches. I do have night vision though. I mean, that's going to help some. Oh, do I want to even do this? I think we need to go right here. We need to go like this. And we need to make new... New... Um, up. Save. Okay, so we got a thing there. Okay, we're not really running into any bad guys, he says, nervously. Guy. 
They don't really hurt me that much, are they? Oh, there's a big slime. There's loot. Which I don't think we care about. So essentially, I think we can just kind of run through here and ignore all the bad guys. Jump over the ones we don't want to fight. Fight the ones that we want to fight. And hopefully find the way down and we can find then the, the Mino, sh Mino Shroom. All right, well, there's the entrance. Okay, let's go this way. I wish I had a map. Is there anything in here, like, worth caring about? And there is some paper. So we might want to bring that with us. If we find a map focus, then that might be pretty handy. So let's let's keep looking. I don't know if we... We don't have a crafting bench, so that's not great. But whatever. Let's just keep on running around here. Um... Can we break that stuff? No. Okay. That's a dead end. Interesting. Okay, there's a chest thing there. for a map focus. Wow, you one shot him with these with this bow. That's awesome. Okay. No map focus either. Okay. The problem that I have in these maps, um, I mean, sometimes you, you like, so we've already been that way, is I have a horrible sense of direction. <laughs> so I have trouble finding my way through this type of stuff because I don't know, like, I, I can never tell if I've been somewhere or not. And we don't have torches, so um, that's not making things any better. Is there a map focus here? Come on, guy. A little bit more paper. So we got to find the way down. I'll tell you what, let me go off camera, and I'll just roam around here a little bit. I mean, I'm not scared of dying. I mean, this is back to the entrance place. Let me just roam around here a little bit, and I'll see if I can't find the way down, and I'll bring you back, and we'll kind of go from there. I mean, we've already looked around to some of these places. We have to find a place that we haven't been to. The problem is, that's that dead end. Okay, we've been there. The problem is, it's hard to find places because... Um, we're not putting torches down. I mean, I guess we could make some torches if we wanted to, but then again, why would we need to do anything like all that crazy? Let's just maybe we'll spend a few more minutes together. Maybe we'll find it. And we'll get kind of lucky. Okay, some bats down here. More treasure, I hope. No map focus, though. We don't have to make that, do we? No. Okay, that's something we find. No. We really don't have any wood, either, which is kind of a bummer. So for the way down. Lots of steel leaf. I guess that's good. If you would like to have steel leaf. Look what I have in my inventory. 
What did that get here? Is there any wood in here that I can... Is there any wood that I can use to make a crafting bench? Hmm. I don't know. Dang it. Okay. Okay. How's my inventory? My inventory is a is an absolute disaster. We have some. Um, we don't need these. I don't think I need this. I don't need this. I'm not going to catch on fire and burn. This can go. Uh, that can go. That's fine. Okay. Oh, we actually have a golden axe that I can use to chop a piece of wood with. Will it break? No. Okay, but now you golden axe is gone. All right, we're gonna take this. We're gonna take this. We're gonna make a crafting bench. We're gonna go like so, and then we're gonna go like this. And put this in the middle, and now we're gonna have a blank maze map. Okay, which we don't want to look at. Where do we just come out of this thing? Right here. All right, we want to go inside. Okay. Now I just guess we have to run around in here. Okay, so this is the edge. This is new, I guess. I don't care about any of that stuff. Actually, wow. Okay, wow. That was many things blasting me all at once. That is for, oh my goodness. Okay, I'm like looking in the dumb thing. Okay, that guy's dead. That guy's dead. Where's the way down? There's water above us. Right here. Okay. Here's the way down. Nice. Ow. Okay, no pitcher bug. Now we just have to find a mushroom, right? There are some mushroom stuff down here. That's handy to see. All right, now, where do we go? We gotta find the mushroom guy. That would be amazing if we could find the mushroom guy. There's mushroom stuff here. Is this where the guy is? No. This is where those, those guys are. Okay. And I'm sort of off the map now. Yeah, that thing said John Cena. Yeah, that's right. I got you, John Cena. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to find this thing, and then we're out, and then we can go, I guess, to kill the Hydra. 
right? I mean, we might as well take these out. And, I, you know, it's funny because this this little run-through that we're doing here sort of validates... <laughs> um, I feel bad for you guys because you already saw Mies, Loy, and Piggy run around inside this maze for a long time this morning. And now here we are again. But in any case, um, it kind of does show the reason why we wanted to do... Okay, there's stuff here. Where's this guy at? No, it's not the guy, but... But anyway, it, tr it shows why Zloy wanted to do that other... That series with us being sort of like geared up in vanilla, vanilla stuff. Because um, this having modded armor and tools does sort of like trivialize the whole thing. Because it's just easy. We're just like rolling around, ignoring mobs, not worrying about dying. Just doing whatever. Alright, we gotta find the, the, the guy. The head honcho. We're gonna shoot him with a bow, and he'll never even touch us. We just gotta find it. Here's like goodies. Anything? No, I don't care about any of that stuff. Let's look in here. Okay, so we're off the map right now, right? I mean, there is one side of this that I guess we haven't discovered. Um, maybe. Let's just keep rolling around here a little bit. We have to sort of go back the other direction, I think. Okay, um, how about you? We still have to find the center. I don't want any jump things. Get out of here. It feels like it should be right around here. But it's not. There's nothing even in those things. Like, why do I even care? I think the answer is I don't. That's just stuff's going to clog them. Oh, you know what we do have, though? Hmm. I don't think we've ever used it. We made that silly ender pouch, and then we've never used it, which was... Not very smart on our part, but let's see what we can find over here. Okay. Dead end. Dead end. Loot. See you later, guys. Okay. Uh, more loot that we don't care about. So, where are we at right now on our map? Okay, we have to get, like, whatever, east. We have to go east. Which is not this way. This way is west. I mean, I guess that other quest we could just complete by coming around through here with all 16 colors of wool and then just handing them off to that guy. Okay. Okay, sort of working our way east. We have to go north as well. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> okay. Oh yeah, we already been back there. Dang it. I hate it when we go the wrong way. This map is not all that handy, helpful. Oh, please. Please be quiet, phone. Okay. Okay, maybe straight through out the other side. Nope, don't want to go that way. Let me go this way. I have to find my way to go. Alright, let me jump off camera. I mean, I've mean, said that like forever, a long ago. I'm going to go off camera, and I'm going to see if I can't find the place where we need to go. And I'll be back with you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Man, look where I'm at on my map. Like, almost right in the center of where all the different mobs are. And I finally found this crazy guy. I've had to go running all around. This thing wasn't a whole lot of help once we came down to the second level. But, that being said, here he is. The crazy guy himself. So we're going to take this, which we still have, and we're going to chop a hole there. Hello? Hello? You're instantly dead. <laughs> okay. Um, we we want the thing. Yeah, we want probably some of that. Um, here. Uh, we don't need that. That's what we need right there. So that should give us the completed quest, right? Back. Yeah, complete. Now we're going to do Hydra, then we do the Night Phantom, then we do your gas, and then we do the Ice Queen. Um, but at some point, we the whole reason that we came here to begin with... Let's make sure these aren't, like, trapped or anything. Is there anything good in here that we care about having? I don't think so. Other than perhaps... Uh, do I need that? No. That I don't need. This we don't need. This, that. Okay, or that. Do we need this ironwood stuff? I don't know if we can complete a quest with that stuff or not. You know, there's some steel leaf pieces. Is there anything that is, like, super exciting? I don't really see anything. No. I mean, there is a... I, I don't even think I want this. I mean, I will probably rue the day. <laughs> um, let's take a look here at our armor quest real quick. I know you guys are probably going to be freaking out if I don't take some of that stuff with me. Uh, let's see. So we do have... We're going to go this way. So we have Arctic Armor. We've got Steel Leaf. We have Nightly. Steel... Okay, so we don't have... We do have Iron Wood, don't we? Iron Wood. How do we make Iron Wood? Oh, here's what we're going to do. Okay, I see how this is going to go. One, two, three, four. That's all we need. And then we can make seeds, right? And we'll grab these other guys. Um, is there a steel leaf? Oh, steel. There is a steel leaf seed, and that's a couple of those things. Oh, man. Now, that we may have gotten ourselves in trouble on, but we'll be able to find more, I'm sure. Because if we... we Came across steel leaf. Let me see. Is there like any way to like smelt that down? Arc furnace. We can do that and get five. With the arc furnace, we can do that to make. Yeah, we need that. We can go with that crazy thing. I'm gonna go back. Okay, there's no way to get. So I wish we had kept some of our steel leaf pieces, but I bet we can find them um, somewhere else, right? And is there a way to make... You know, obviously that, we need that for. Is there a way to make... This. Actorizer. Hmm. Okay, I'll take a look and see. Alright, so I'm not too worried about it. So my plan was, after we got this thing done, um, to just teleport out. Right? Let's do that. Let's go let's go back to the house. 
Oh, this has been a long... I mean, this is, it took me a long time to find that guy. I mean, no question. Oh my goodness, it was forever. Okay, let's go here. And let me just make sure... Yeah, we don't have any steel leaf, so we might have to make sure we grab some. I'm sure there's other places to get some. We just have to make sure we bring some home with us so we can make um, the things that we need to whenever we have a chance. Okay, so the question is now, uh, my, the reason why I wanted to teleport home is because I didn't want to spend time in the episode trying to find our way back outside of that that thing. Let's go and dump a we got an and I'm getting a little bit low on power, but I think I can probably... I'd like to knock out the Hydra if we possibly could in this episode. I don't need that. That I don't need. This I don't need. That, that, that. I don't need these cool share bags. Those are really cool. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. We don't need those. Um, I don't think we're going to need these. Let's just take one with us just in case we need it. Um, these guys, I don't know. We can put those in there. All right, let's go. We have our trophies. Let's see if we can find a Hydra really quickly. Oh, oh, okay, here. I mean, everything's full still. This is taking a little bit of damage, but nothing too bad. I mean, we've taken some, we took some hits from those um, crazy mushroom guys. Man, I hate those things. All right, let's find our map, and let's see if we can't find their hydras right there. I'm just going to have to run over there super quick. So I think we should be able to get this done in this episode. It shouldn't take too long. I mean, we're coming up on like 35 minutes in this episode. So if we can get this episode done. The thing I'm really worried about is draining my capacitor out. And then... Oh, I should have brought wool. And then not having enough um, power to, to run my bow. And stuff like that. So I think that's going to be the key. Okay. Oh, I got it. Oh, my goodness. There's a Lich Tower. Well, we have a long way to go. Um, I might... Uh, I'll tell you what, let's, let me just break the video. I'm going to cut the video again. We killed the Mushroom guy. Let me get over here. That's why I don't have to like worry about you know getting all anxious about getting over here before we can finish the video. And then I'll bring you back when we get to the Hydra. We'll try to own that guy up, and then we'll call this episode a done deal. I'll see you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Now, this is the second time I ran over here to this spot. If you take a look at our map, right, you can see that we're right over here by the Hydra. He should be right over there. The problem is, is we can't go in to this place. Because, even though we uh, fought them, the buffalo guy, see all that stuff flying around? It burns us. Yeah, see how it burns us? Um, which is not good. Hello, Kobold. How are you? You're here to tell me that uh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, so I got all the way over here. I started getting burnt, and I had to go back to the house and get one of these guys. The Meef Stroganoff things. Oh my goodness, now I don't know how to make myself hungry. This has to go on the ground, I guess. I have so much saturation that I can't even get hungry. I don't want to put that there. Um, I think I can put it in here, though. And it won't go anywhere. Yeah. Okay. Um, I can also put like some of this other stuff in here too. Okay. Maybe if I take a bunch of damage, no, that's just going to drain my capacitor. That's not going to get the job done either. I got to get to the point where I, I'm hungry and I can eat. Um, let's take all of this stuff. Let's use this for like a temporary storage. Right, I can put um, all of this stuff in here for now, and that can go in. <gasps> what in the world? Oh, okay. Whew, okay, I have like 
had like a little mini heart attack. <laughs> There's no way. Okay. Oh man. Um, I just put this stuff in here for now. Okay. How am I? How am I hungry? Am I hungry? No. Why am I getting more food? All right. So now if I go over here, right, I don't have fancy armor to protect me, or like, so I just have the saturation thing. So if I go over here and get burned up. I mean, I'm not taking any damage. Oh, because I have fire resistance. So I'm not even taking any damage. I mean, I don't know how to... I can't take fall damage, either. The hydra's right over there. Um, this is, uh, not great. I mean, the other option I have is I could just fight the Hydra like this. Hey. How are you guys? Will you do some damage to me? So I can eat the meat stroganoff? Please don't kill me! Oh my goodness! Yes, I know you little raggedy thing. Can I eat yet? Please let me eat soon. I'm almost there. Yes, okay. Okay, there we go. So now this thing should go away. Yeah, okay. That's exactly what I need. Okay. So now, like five days later, we can grab all this stuff back out of here. And I'm wearing my armor. I've got my jetpack off, right? I don't need that thing. Okay, now let's go take on the Hydra. It's going to be a little bit longer than normal episode. What is that stuff? Dry to breed. Okay. But that's okay. Let's get our handy dandy fire sword out. We still have fire resistance. Oh, we also need this. Hello, Hydra. Hello. They can't really hurt me. So I can stand in there. So I just have to wait for the, the mouths that are going to shoot the items at me. Like this guy, right? Yep. So he's shooting bats over there. Okay, I don't care about that fire guy. That's going to be fire. Okay. Hello? It feels kind of cheaty. You do a very good job there. That's fire coming out of that guy's mouth. I can't, like, shoot this guy, like, ranged. Oh, I can. I can also just melee him. Let's do it this way. We're steamrolling through this crazy Twilight Forest. It's a lot easier when you have when you have like full like jacked up gear. Okay, so it's gonna like give me trouble. Okay. He's starting to gain health. Hey. Oh, he's gaining health back. No, 
there's another head. Now there's more of them that I can reflect stuff back. I think this is a good strat. Hello? Can one of you guys shoot the stuff that I reflect back? Not, and not turn around and shoot it at a bat or something? Oh, this guy. Hello? Okay, this guy. Hi. Can one of you guys please? Oh, he, like this guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, like this guy now? He's almost dead. I need one more like like this guy. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that was a ridiculous fight. Okay. Alright. What's he doing? Is he still like exploding? So now we got the Hydra Trophy. We got another one of these shader bags. We got some of this fiery blood. So that's awesome. So this should give us the Hydra. Yeah? Okay. And empower myself. So now I'm empowered. Now, if we take a look at our quests back. Um, right here, uh, this one, yeah. So now we got to do the Phantom Trophy. We've got to do the Yurgast, and we got to do the Ice Queen. Maybe we can knock out all of those next time. I don't know. I was okay. We steamrolled through this thing. Not too much drama, that's for sure. Um, we still haven't gotten to the Ice Cave, so I think we probably need to do that next time. And that's the whole reason we came here. And we were gonna try to see if we could capture one of these things. Um, Arctic Yeti. Yeah, there's not like a seed or anything. The only way to get that is to get that from the actual guy itself. So I don't know how we're going to make that happen. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it so much. Until next time, please remember to be cool. Don't be a fool. And from my Project Ozone 3 series, where we just like steamrolled through four or five bosses in the Twilight Forest. I love it. I guess we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.